Hakuna Matata, my friend. Canon has just released a new firmware update for the Canon C70. And there's a few key features with this new firmware update. But there's a main key feature that, according to Canon, is going to bring the Canon C70 to the level of the Canon C500 Mark II and also Canon 300 Mark III. Really exciting. In this video, so we're going to look at those two key features, which is one is the recording format and the second one is the recording mode. So we're going to look at them in the current firmware and then we're going to look at them in the new firmware. And then we're going to compare them, put them side by side to see what are those additional that Canon is bringing. So we do for the recording format and also we do for the recording mode. And also why Canon saying that that is the key feature which will raise the stake of the Canon C70. I'm Kolbasia. Welcome to Cash Camps. Before getting that video, I'm giving away this Mavic Air drone when I reach 1,000 subscribers. Three simple steps. First, you need to subscribe to my channel and also press the notification bell next to it. Second, you need to like this video. And third, last thing, in the comment box below, write your name and say I enter. If you do those three things, so then I know that you enter the giveaway to win this Mavic Air drone when I reach 1,000 subscribers. So here is the current C70 menu. First and foremost, let's look at what is the current firmware. Okay, let's go into find the firmware. So here, and I think this is the last point. Ah, here it is, firmware. So let's check. So the current firmware is 1.0, 0 0.2, 0 0.1. I don't know how Canon gonna call the new one, but you know, that's the current one. All right, so next thing, let's go into looking at the recording format. So go to the menu, all right, and then we go to find where is the recording format. So here and in here, so we go number one, all right, here it is. So that is the recording format. I'm just gonna select it and then we see the list of the different format that we have. All right, so here we have the format. 1XFAVC, 10-bit 422, and then we have free MP4 format. So one is 10-bit 422, the second one is 10-bit 420, and the last one is 8-bit 420. So that is the current firmware, that is the current recording format. All right, so now let's look at what is the new firmware update gonna bring in terms of the recording format. Great. So here we have the new firmware update with the new recording format. So we have addition. So we have the four that we have as in the current firmware, the XFAVC, the MP4 10-bit 422, the MP4 10-bit 420, the MP4 8-bit 420. And then we have in addition, we have row LT, Raw ST. Let me add this one. According to the information about the firmware, so in terms of the raw, we have three quality setting of the raw. So we have raw ST is mean for standard, raw LT mean is mean for light, and then we we have raw HQ mean high quality. So in terms of the raw, we have three quality. But for now. What we see, we see only those two. So we'll find out when Canon gonna launch, gonna release the new firmware update. Okay, so here are the format side by side, current, current firmware and also the propose or the new firmware. And you can see, so we have raw in addition to those four that we have in the current firmware. All right, so what Canon is saying is that this addition in terms of the row going to bring the Canon C70 to the level of the Canon C500 Mark II and also the Canon C300 Mark III. It mean in terms of the quality, you can use, you can mix those cameras together. No problem at all.
Okay, so now let's look at the recording mode. So let me go into the menu of the current firmware and then we can see what we have there. So here we have recording mode and let's select the recording mode. So here we have, you know, the list of the mode, right? So we have normal recording, we have slow and fast motion and this one without sound and then we have slow and fast uh, clip. This one with a sound, with an audio. But the audio will be recorded in the second SD card. And then we have pre-recording. So we have four mode in that recording mode. Great. So now let's look at what is Canon proposing with the new firmware. Okay. So here we have, you know, the menu for the new firmware. So we have, in addition to those four that we have with the current firmware, which is normal recording, slow and fast, slow and fast of audio, and pre-recording. So now we have addition something such as frame recording and also interval recording. Let me just explain to you what is frame recording and also interval recording. In the lamb term, in the simple term that we know, frame recording is just another way of saying stop motion. Uh, if you understand, if you know what stop motion, frame recording is just stop motion. And then interval recording, just in a simple term, is time lapse. All right. So what we have new with that new firmware update in terms of the recording mode, so now with the Canon C70, when you update it, you can also record stop motions and as well you can record time lapse all right my friend if you're still watching right now and you still have not given me a thumbs up please do give me a thumbs up because that will help my channel grow and also will help the algorithm thinking that my video a great video and people like it all right let's get back to the video so now let's put them side by side with the current firmware and also the new firmware. All right. So when we look side by side, yeah. So we have the four normal recording, slow and fast, slow and fast with audio and pre-recording as such as in the current version. And then on top of that, we have frame recording or stop motion, and then we have interval recording. So now let's look at a little bit, let's dig a little bit deeper in terms of the frame recording and also interval recording. What does that mean? So then in the frame recording, you have a frame record, frame rate. Basically, you need to choose the frame rate to create the stop motion. And then in that frame recording or stop motion, so you have different frame rate. So you have one, you have three, you have six, and you have nine. I don't know why they're moving three, 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 three by three, by three, by three, but you know, kind of knows that. So then if you want to do your stop motion frame by frame, so then you choose frame one. And if you wanna jump three frames, so you choose then and then, then. So that's how you create, how does you record stop motion with the Canon C70 when the new firmware update will hit our camera, right? So now let's look at the time lapse. And as I said to you before, is that the option that you have in terms of recording time lapse with the Canon C70 is only 15 frames per second, right? That is it, so 15 frames per second. So now let's look at what is the new frame rate or the new mode that interval recording bring or time lapse bring. So here we are in interval recording or time lapse. And so you can choose the time interval, one second, two second, 10 second, whatever that you can choose now is like proper, you know, time lapse setting. And then after choosing, you know, your time interval, you can choose your frame rate. So now we can have a proper proper time lapse than what we have before as only 15 you know second or 15 frame per second 
So that's in terms of the, you know, time time lapse or or recording interval. Uh, if you're still watching and then you find this video useful and the information useful, please give me a thumbs up. Please like this video because it will help my channel grow and also tell YouTube algorithm that the video I'm making a uh, great video. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Do you own the Canon C70? And if so, what do you think about the new firmware update and also the new key feature that will be coming with the new firmware update? All right, my friends. So those are two key features that I want to share with you right now that I believe that is going to push up the stake of the Canon C70. And when Canon will release the new firmware, firmware in March, I'm going to update the Canon C70 and then I'm going to take through I'm going to take you through all the new key feature or all the new feature with that new firmware update. Do you think that I have missed a key important feature with that Canon C70 firmware update? And if so, please use the comment box below and tell us what is that key feature that I have missed. So, my friend, the Canon C70 is going to be a beast of the camera. With now with the addition of, you know, you can recall time lapse, you can you can recall stop motion, and also with the addition of the raw, the cinema raw light into it. I am really excited about the Canon C70. I have never dubbed the Canon C70, but now I'm even more proud that I have invested in the Canon C70, my friend. Akuna Matata, my friend. I hope you find this video useful. And if so, peace and love from me. And I love you guys, and I will see you in my next video. Stay safe, stay protected, yeah? Ciao, bye now. Bye.